In this lesson, we're going to examine different land segment types, and we're going to see how we can deploy different devices to create a more optimized network. In this scenario, like we talked about in a previous lesson, if I have a thousand devices all attached to a single network segment, I have created one broadcast domain and one collision domain in a very inefficient network. If I want to separate my collision domain and I have a network requirement to create two collision domains, then I need to insert a bridge or better yet, a switch into my network to divide up my collision domains. That way I have lessened the number of devices in each collision domain, therefore reducing the chance that two stations are going to try to send the information at the same time and have a collision. Now if I have a requirement to divide my network up into two broadcast domains, at that point I need to insert a router into my network because a router is the only device that can separate broadcast domains. So in this case I would make two different networks and then route the information between those two different networks, creating two different broadcast domains. So if station C decides to send a broadcast, those frames will be sent out to all the other stations on the right side of this network to process. But as those packets travel towards the router, when it hits the router, that information will be dropped. It won't travel any further to stations A, B, or E, or 